Welcome everybody, Film Fan 108 here with a brand new Blu-ray and DVD out and about video for you guys today. And there is a decent amount of stuff that comes out today. You have the action movie Atomic Blonde finally hitting on Blu-ray and DVD. You have the indie drama Wind River coming out. You also have the horror movie Amityville The Awakening hitting on Blu-ray. You also have, I believe, Preacher Season 2. And you have Shout Select releasing The Incredible Shrinking Woman and Screen Factory releasing the Paul Nashi collection number two. So let's go see the exclusives, the deals, what they have in the stores today. And we are at our first location, Walmart. So let's go in and see what they got. All right, we are in at Walmart. And the first thing I'm seeing is this display for Atomic Blonde here. And the first thing that I see here is the Blu-ray, DVD, and digital of Atomic Blonde for $19.96. And witness the birth of a new and original hero. Well, I will say that Bob and I reviewed this movie, and it's under the movie review playlist if you want to check it out. And we really enjoyed it. You know, we... We thought it was kind of the female version of John Wick, which actually is probably the truth. I mean, she's just as kick-ass as John Wick is, honestly. And Charlize Theron is awesome in this movie. She really is. James McAvoy is great in it. And John Goodman. Everyone is really great in the movie, and the action scenes are really kick-ass as well. It's a really awesome movie. The 4K Ultra HD is $22.96. And this would probably look really good in 4K as well. The special features are actually not bad either. If you can see all these special features. Yeah, they're not bad, honestly. I'm glad this didn't get a bare bones release. I am glad it didn't. And the DVD of Atomic Blonde is... 1796 and yeah the same cover so they're all the same no exclusive so far that I can see here at Walmart but yeah it is a really great movie if you haven't checked it out I absolutely recommend you guys doing that because it's absolutely worth it but this is the display for Atomic Blonde let's see what else Walmart has Alright, we are at this display now, and uh, no exclusives over here for Atomic Blonde, unfortunately. But the other thing I'm seeing over here is the Blu-ray, DVD, and digital of The Nut Job 2, Nutty by Nature. Now this came out today as well, and it's got a ton of people in this. Will Arnett, Maya Rudolph, Jackie Chan, Katherine Heigl, well you name it, wow. And I freely admit I have never seen either The Nut Job 2 or The Nut Job. I have never seen them. Again, these type of movies are not really my thing, um, unless you have kids, and I think this probably would be down their alley. Um, yeah. The Blu-ray, DVD, and digital is $19.96, and the DVD is $17.96. And they also have this only at Walmart exclusive that has both the DVD of The Nut Job 2 and The Nut Job in a package for $19.96. So, you know, if you don't mind regular standard DVD, it's $19.96. And the Blu ray just for the second movie alone is $19.96. So, eh, not a bad deal. Not a bad deal at all. You know, again, these are kind of little cute animated movies, but they're not something that I generally watch. If you guys have watched it and like it or not, let me know. I don't know. And the next thing I'm seeing over here is I'm seeing the DVD of Wind River for $14.96. And Nick and I reviewed this movie, and you can check it under the movie review playlist. And we really love this movie. I didn't know what to expect going into it. 
the trailers are great and so it was a really interesting movie to watch Jeremy Renner and Elizabeth Olsen are fantastic in the movie and we showed last week uh, Ingrid Goes West that Elizabeth Olsen is also in and she's in this movie as well she's fantastic in both movies she's a really great actress and I hope she gets more roles too also the blu-ray for 1996 and the only thing that sucks here is that there's not a lot of special features. There's deleted scenes and behind the scenes, and that's kind of it. I was hoping for a commentary. I was hoping for, like, a making of. Because the movie is very fascinating, and I wanted sort of more clarification on why they came up with the story. You know, um, how was the shooting on an Indian reservation, that kind of stuff. But no, I didn't get any of that. Maybe a future release down the line. Maybe even a Criterion. I don't know, but it's going to be a while. And then this movie, Christmas in the Air, a Hallmark movie. Uh, you know, now we're getting into the, getting close to Christmas time, and now everyone's putting out all their Christmas movie DVDs. Yay! Look, guys, I'm I'm Jewish, so this Christmas movie stuff really does not get me at all but maybe it gets you guys <laughs> it doesn't do it for me and then an animated movie Mariah Carey's All I Want for Christmas is You all new movie includes three Mariah Carey classic Christmas songs uh, Mariah Carey narrates the film based on her best selling song well I figured it was going to happen eventually they're making animated movies for singers now. I mean, and not just like singers just being in it for the, for the sake of being in it. Them tailor making animated movies for singers. I don't know. It it could be good. It could not. I don't know. Twelve ninety six and the Blu rays fourteen ninety six. I wouldn't buy it, but they're not making many animated Hanukkah movies. Just put it that way. And down here, I'm seeing Amityville, The Awakening, on Blu-ray and digital HD. And I gotta admit, guys, um, I watched this on digital streaming. It was free. And I invited Bob over and a couple of my friends, and we watched this movie. And this movie is terrible. This is a terrible, terrible movie. <laughs> and... Honestly, it just really, really was not good. It was really a bore, to be honest with you. It really was. Not not only was it a bore, but it just, it wasn't scary. There was nothing scary about it. I, you know, I mean, now it's out to get if you guys are a fan of the Amityville series or, you know, own them all. And God knows how many Amityville movies there are. I haven't even kept track. If you guys know how many Amityville movies there is, please comment and let me know. Because I, I think there's like, I know there's, I think there's over 10. I think there has to be, but I don't know. 1496 for the Blu-ray, 1296 for the DVD. And also they have this movie, Brigsby Bear. And I kind of remember seeing the trailer for this. Um, it's got Claire Danes, Mark Hamill, Greg Kinnear. Huh. A truly original really remarkable touching movie. I don't know about this movie, guys. Honestly, swear to God. It looks really weird, though. It looks really weird. James has a grown up with the Goofy Kids. I mean, there's actually a lot of cool features on this, but I have no idea about this movie. Uh, if you guys do, let me know. The cover kind of looks interesting. I just don't know about the whole, like, bear thing. Is it a kids movie i don't know uh 1996 for the blu-ray the dvd here is 1496 and the next thing i'm seeing here is oh let's put the dvd back where it belongs is six below for 1496 the blu-ray and it has josh hartnett and mira servino um Seeking Isolation Thrills and Altitude, Eric Lamarck, Assault Stranded by A.T. Frozen, Joseph Dermian. Hmm. That's interesting. Six Below. 
you know, I haven't seen Mira Servino in anything in a really long time. Man, that is crazy. I haven't seen her in a really long time. I remember seeing her in movies like Mimic and um, and that movie she did with Chow Yun-Fat. I forget the name of that now. It's escaping me. She's actually a really good actress, and I'd like to see her in more stuff. Six Below. Hmm. Might be something interesting. I do like the actual cover of that. That's not bad. And the DVD is twelve ninety six. And hmm, not bad. And the next thing I'm seeing here is the Secret Scripture. It's got Rooney Mara in it, Vanessa Redgrave, Eric Bana, Theo James. Not a bad cast. Hmm. Hmm. Movie looks kind of interesting. The cast looks great. I have not heard of this movie. It seems like one of those World War movies about, like, love and war and everything. That's kind of what I'm getting from it. But if you guys have seen it, let me know. The DVD is $12.96. I'm also seeing... The DVD of Preacher season two for twenty two ninety six, and I have not seen either Preacher season one or Preacher season two. I've never read any of the comic books. The 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 trailers for season one didn't do it for me. I wasn't a fan of it. I really wasn't. And you know, honestly. It just, it didn't interest me. I mean, I do have my friend who watches it who says it's not terrible. And it's actually not bad at all. But, um, yeah, the Blu-ray and digital is twenty-seven ninety-six, And there's not a lot of special features here. You know, I'm noticing a lot of TV seasons now are not having a lot of a lot of special features. And it really sucks. It really does. Because cause I really, honestly, I wish they would have more special features. Because if you're paying the money for the Blu-ray and digital, you kind of want more special features. Also, I'm seeing the DVD here of Unlocked. With Numi Rapace, Orlando Bloom, John Malkovich, and Michael Douglas. Now that, folks, is a cast. It kind of looks interesting. CIA interrogators. Hmm. Sort of probably about, I would guess, sort of betrayal and, you know, um trying to find out the truth and getting set up and it kind of sounds like that to me I don't know about that one and the blu-ray and digital is only fourteen ninety six. the truth has many enemies yeah it kind of it kind of sounds like that type of movie unfortunately there's not many special features here I wish there was oh. I may have to watch it at some point I do like Numi Rapace. I think she's actually a really good actress. Doesn't get as many roles as she should, but I think she's actually really great. Hmm. And that seems to be it over here at Walmart. All right, let's head to the next location, guys. Okay, not too bad of a selection over here at Walmart. And I was noticing a lot of people kind of looking at me when I was filming. Uh, I get that nowadays, you know. I guess they've never seen actually people filming or they've never seen YouTube before. Who knows? Uh, let's go over to the second location and see what they got. All right, we are at our second location, Tarjay. So let's go in and see if they at least have one exclusive for this week. Just one. Let's find out. All right, we are at Target here, and the first thing I'm seeing is their 4K Ultra HD release of Atomic Blonde for $22.99. Right here, and I also see their Blu ray, DVD, and digital only at Target collectible packaging and art cards 
Wow, they have an exclusive over Walmart? What? Yeah, who knew? Uh, you know what? This cover is actually pretty cool. I like this cover as well. This cover is not bad either. I don't know which cover is better though. Hard to say. $19.99 for the exclusive. Alright guys, sorry about that. I had to cut the video real quick because there was this friggin' jackass that came right in front of me and didn't say excuse me or anything, so I like had to cut the video real quick. You know, real nice, doesn't even say excuse me. Uh, talk about manners today. But anyway, we have the regular Blu-ray DVD and digital for $19.99 here. And again, this is a good cover. Not sure whether that's the better cover or this. Not sure. Again, I really like the special features here. And I wish this movie did better in, in the box office. It kind of kind of bombed a little bit at the box office because I really wanted to see a sequel they kind of set it up at the end of the movie for a sequel I won't really spoil anything but you're kind of like I, I want to know more I want to know more about her and I want to know more about you know uh, her backstory and everything and you don't get really many hints of it they kind of leave it for a possible sequel and the movie didn't do well enough I don't think for a sequel. I'm hoping we eventually get one. Fingers crossed. You also have the DVD here for $17.99. Well, and I'm also seeing here, I'm seeing Wind River for Blu-ray and Digital HD for $19.99. And again, really great movie. Really fantastic movie. If you guys haven't checked it out yet, or you were waiting for Blu-ray or DVD or digital, now's the time. It was absolutely worth it. And I'm also seeing the Blu-ray of Amityville The Awakening for $14.99. And I think the guy who is in this movie actually, I believe, plays on Gotham. I think he plays sort of the Joker. I could be wrong think hmm yeah it's it's not really worth your time guys honestly it really isn't it's a real bore and not scary is it worth a watch maybe but it's like a one-time thing and that's it but that's that's up to you guys the other thing I'm seeing over here is preacher Season 2 on DVD for $24.99. And I don't see the Blu-ray, so it must just be that they have the DVD. And I do like Dominic Cooper. Hmm. If it is worth a watch, let me know, guys. Because, again, I wasn't in impressed by the trailer to the first season so I kind of never really started to get into it but if you guys like it or you think I should at least give the first few episodes a watch let me know and the other thing I'm seeing over here is I'm seeing the nut job to nutty by nature blu-ray for $19.99 here and the DVD for $17.99 and hmm yeah not my kind of movie but if if you have kids I assume this is probably up their alley anything for the kids right all right that'll do it for Target guys let's get out of here all right actually not bad stuff from Target today at least one exclusive and that's more than we could ever say for Walmart this week. And I wish I had filmed that jackass in my way here at Target. I didn't, and I wish I did, because he was rude. He just came right up in front of me, and I had to stop the video because he was in the way. I couldn't, you know, film around him. But if I see that guy again, 
he gets in my way, I will film him. Trust me. All right, guys, let's go to our third and final location. All right, at our third and final location, the Beast, Best Buy. So let's see if this week the shelves aren't as bare as they were last week. Hopefully they've done all their reset stuff and we can actually find the releases that we want to this week. All right, let's get going. All right, we are in at Best Buy, and the first thing I'm seeing is Atomic Blonde on DVD for $17.99. And you also have the Blu-ray DVD and digital here for $19.99. Both the same cover, but they have an only at Best Buy exclusive steelbook patch packaging for the Blu-ray DVD and digital of Atomic Blonde. And you know what, guys? I'm not a big fan of steelbooks, but this is a nice, nice steelbook. It looks gorgeous. It really does. And, yeah, it looks gorgeous. Same backing, but, yeah, that looks fantastic. I love the art on this. Huh. And that is $22.99. And you also have the 4K Ultra HD for $22.99 as well. So both of these are the same price. And you also have the 4K Ultra HD and Blu-ray Digital 4K Steelbook. So it's the same Steelbook as this one, but just in 4K. And that is $27.99 as well. And boy, that is a that is a nice Steelbook. That really is. If you if you like Steelbooks, get your hands on this one. This is a nice one. It really is and also they have Brigsby Bear for $17.99 here and again I still don't know what the hell Brigsby Bear is I really don't this is just a weird looking movie if you guys know anything about this let me know it's a remarkably touching comedy okay Maybe it is, but it looks really weird to me. Then you have the Blu-ray and digital HD of Wind River for $19.99. And just to let you guys know, this has a really, you know, just fascinating message about women and being abducted and especially Indian reservations. It's a fascinating movie and definitely, definitely worth a watch, guys. And I'm also seeing here the Nut Job 2 Nutty by Nature for $22.99. Hmm. Kids are going to eat this one up. It's $22.99. And... Hmm. Nothing else on this side. And then I'm seeing over here, actually, they have some steelbooks for the Christmas season. They have the Polar Express steelbook. Very nice. They have Chevy Chase and National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation steelbook. Very nice. They have a Christmas Story steelbook. Now... I told you guys earlier in the video, I'm Jewish. Christmas movies aren't my thing, but this is one of my all-time favorite movies and one of my favorite holiday movies of all time, Christmas Story. Love, love this movie. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. Love this movie. Then they have this Steelbook of Elf. And if you guys watched the Daddy's Home 2 review, then you know I'm not the biggest fan of Will Ferrell. You know, sorry guys, I'm just not. And they also have these, this sort of Blu-ray DVD digital of The Grinch Stole Christmas, new deluxe edition, limited time only, and it has this, like the, the Grinch's fur. It's really weird. Whoa. I don't know. I'd, I'd just be kind of weird to own, having the Grinch's fur on your on your Blu-ray. I don't know. Hmm. Um, they also have the Santa Claus on a widescreen special edition here as well. And actually, 
This is actually a really fantastic movie as well. I really love A Christmas Story, but I also really love The Santa Claus as well. That's actually really good. And then they also have this complete three movie collection, which has The Santa Claus, Santa Claus 2, and Santa Claus 3 on Blu-ray as well. I only really like the first movie. I watched the second movie and the third and they did nothing for me, but that first one is, to me, considered a classic. But actually, this is really nice packaging with Tim Allen's face on there. Yeah, that's actually really nice. If you like the Santa Claus movies, it's $29.99 for all three on Blu-ray. It's actually a really good price. And the other thing I'm seeing here is I'm seeing Preacher Season 2 on DVD for $22.99. Hmm. I like the cover, though. The cover is really nice. Hmm. I like the purple and everything. It's really cool. And then the Blu-ray is $27.99. I do, is, is Preacher getting a season three? Cause I'm not sure, again, I don't follow Preacher, so I'm not sure about it. But, you know, some of the characters are really interesting looking people. I will say that much, you know. Again, let me know if I should give this a chance or not. And that should do it for this section for the new releases. Let's see what else Best Buy's got. All right, and we're over in this section of Best Buy, and I'm seeing over here Amityville, The Awakening on Blu-ray and Digital HD for $14.99. Yeah, it's, it's not a movie I'm interested in ever getting. I know this movie was delayed like crazy, and it was filmed like, I think a couple years ago or something and then they put it on digital for free it just the release of this thing is incredibly weird it's $14.99 honestly guys dead serious wait until this movie comes into the five dollar bin really swear to god I think you know even at five dollars it still isn't worth it but at least you might you know be at peace with your conscience but don't seriously and I'm also seeing one of the releases from last week that I see here this week is Mother Krampus for $9.99 that cover is really cool though not sure if I would be investing in a Krampus movie again but that cover does have me intrigued also the show for $16.99 and they also finally have the glass castle over here for $22.99 for the blu-ray DVD and digital and I'm also seeing over here the movie with Josh Hartnett and Mira Servino six below Miracle on the Mountain Like I said, I do like Mira Sorvino, and Josh Hartnett is actually a pretty good actor as well. I like the team up. Interesting. And you know what? I think that's it for this section over at Best Buy. Yeah. So, let's uh, get out of here, shall we? All right, some good selection over at Best Buy, and at least the shelves are restocked, so, you know, it doesn't look too bare like it did last week. Uh, all right, let's get home and finish the video, guys. All right, everybody, that'll do it for the Blu-ray DVD out and about video today, and some decent stuff at the stores today, decent releases, not a ton of major exclusives, but I believe next week there's a ton of stuff coming out, so definitely be prepared for a lot of exclusives, or at least let's hope for a lot of exclusives but i uh, did pick up something over at walmart one of the new releases but you guys will not exactly get to see what i picked up until my blu-ray pickups video for november that drops on december 1st definitely check it out when it drops and if you've enjoyed the video definitely give it a thumbs up and if you're new to the channel welcome 
Hope you've enjoyed this video and check out my other content on the channel, whether it's movie reviews, whether it's Blu-ray out and about, Netflix nice, check them out. And if you like what you see, hit subscribe and you will get more of it. Also make sure that you are hitting that little bell for the notification so that you will be notified every single time that I make a video. Also, I'm on Twitter and Facebook, FilmFan108, so check me out there as well. Guys, I will see you next time for another Blu-ray, DVD, out and about video. Take care, guys.